bones, 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 bones. <laughs> what a bunch of sickly cows, right? Because of the genetics of this dairy cow, they are naturally quite lean. So a healthy dairy cow, you should be able to see some of their ribs and even their hip bones and their pin bones and sometimes even some of their vertebrae. A healthy cow, you should be able to see all that. It's kind of like myself. I'm naturally quite lean as well and I eat an ungodly amount of food and yet you can still see my ribs. On the other hand, a cow like this one right here, she's getting kind of fluffy and that's because she had a hard time getting pregnant so she was on this milking cow ration for a longer period of time than they normally would be. So you can see, you can still see some of her hip bones and her pin bones, but her ribs have all but disappeared and you don't see her vertebrae very well. You still see some bones, but not the same way. And even though this cow might look a little healthier, in actuality, she's not. So because of her higher body condition, when she goes to have her next calf, she'll start breaking down a lot of fat just to meet her energy demands. And a byproduct of breaking down that fat is ketones which will give her the keto flu, very similar to what you hear in people trying the keto diet, and she'll feel off. And because of she feels off, she won't go and eat as much, which keeps that cycle going of keeping her in ketosis. And then also, uh, further from her not eating as much, she runs a higher risk of uh, getting a displaced abomasum, flipping her stomach, and getting sick from that. Or she could also have a high risk of developing a uterus infection after calving, which then another byproduct of the uterus infection is then she has a hard time getting pregnant. This overall, she usually just doesn't feel quite as good, so she won't peak her milk production as high, so her whole lactation, she'll produce a lot less milk and become a less efficient animal. And all in all, she'll just be a sickly cow. And it's all from that having a body condition that looks healthy, but is actually heavier than what her natural body condition should be. So essentially, you gotta be careful to not judge a book by its cover. This cow might be bony, but she's chewing her cud, she's happy, and she's very healthy.